Happy Friday, July 16, 2021. To God be the glory for yet another beautiful beginning of the weekend. Summertime, we're smack dab in the middle. And second half for some of us, some of us will be going back to work or school full time. Listen, wherever you are, as far as your schedule, know that this is the Lord's doing. He has done great things this day because he has made it. He has created this opportunity for us to glorify him. We are in the second chapter of Esther, and we know this is when we find out that she was appointed as the new queen. She replaced Queen Vashti. Remember, she was the one who was like, I am not going in front of those folks and parading my beauty. Okay, so we understand that Esther was a young virgin and that's what they used to do in those days they would collect all the cuties and they would parade the women and then whoever was the one who gained the favor she was the one chosen and we know that Hadassah or Esther was the one who was most fair, beautiful, had a gorgeous figure, and she was given the beauty treatment for months, oils, myrrh, all of that. And this made me think of a celebrity, Valerie Bertinelli. You remember her, yeah. And she's 61 years old, and this week she broke down and she was just talking about trolls on social media, talking about her weight because she used to be a spokesperson for Jenny Craig and she put on weight. And we know that all of our pounds have gone up and down, especially during this pandemic. Listen, our hope, our trust, our identity is not on that scale because if that's the case, anything external, please. It will have you going crazy. But our definition of who we are, our value is internal. And the sooner we realize that, then come what may, what around us, we still will have peace and happiness. Now, that does not let us off the hook as far as being a good steward of our body. The Lord just... Uh, said Michelle those french fries even though you're a vegan how many people know that you can be plant based potatoes and still eat junk vegan junk french fries yes like, oh lord please give it up for the rest of the summer oh okay so I don't know what you're struggling with maybe it's chips maybe cakes I don't know pizza but the Lord wants us to be free from all idols yes he does and in verse we're in Psalms 104 because we know that we would have gone to that actually Psalms 106 and it says in verse 36 and they served their idols which were a snare unto them. The Lord will reveal what is a snare as far as things we love to eat, we enjoy, because we can turn anything, any person, any entity, into a snare and then an uh, idol. And then before you know it, we, we, we packed on these pounds and we're like, wait, well, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. Mm -hmm. The Lord wants us to be free of all of that so that we can do His will and we have the freedom that we don't have things that we have done ourselves as far as we know that diabetes, high blood pressure, heart disease, you know, all these other ailments are because of the diet. Ooh, the Lord speaking to me. Yea, they despise the pleasant land verse 24 they believe not his word the lord supplied the good things of the land he's like michelle you better eat more of those vegetables even though you're eating them but more of the pleasant things and stop 
<clears throat> eating so many much of the party food even vegan party food yes but esther had someone in her life a mordecai mordecai challenged her and he advised her and he he guided her steps who are you being a mordecai to i know i tell my uncle that um he, he has become a Mordecai in my adult years. My Uncle Carl, he, he, he's the one you will see giving me feedback, saying, good job, and then this, okay, and correcting me. That's what the Lord wants us to be in someone's life, to be a friend, an advisor, a confidant. Yeah, because Esther's parents were gone. Neither father nor mother was around, and maybe... The Lord has placed you in someone's life where they don't have a husband or a wife or children. You be that person. You be that Mordecai. And the Lord will bless you and he will send Mordecai's in your life when you need that cheer. All right. So know that God wants us to be free of all idols and he wants us to sharpen iron as we're being sharpened. God, we thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. We thank you for the opportunity to receive your revelation. Father, let us challenge one another to greater things, Father, so that we will experience true health. You said that you will show us the path of life. In your presence is fullness of joy, and at your right hand are pleasures evermore. Father, let us experience that every day of our life as we experience the abundant things. In Jesus' name, we pray and we claim all of these for our lives. Amen.